Okay, so back to the navigation. You already have seen, you can use your mouse wheel for scrolling out and scrolling in, zooming, so to speak, zooming in and wherever the mouse is, you will zoom to. So if I have the mouse here, I will go to the horizon. If I go back and I put the mouse here on the guy with the ukulele and the dinosaur shirt, we will zoom into the dinosaur. Okay, and then the mouse wheel also can click. So you can click on the mouse wheel and you see you get this rotate tool which lets you orbit around a certain center. And this is very helpful. So always, if you want to rotate, have your finger on the mouse wheel and click the mouse wheel. And if you want to move in one direction only and for example, parallel to this green axis here, well, click the mouse wheel to get the orbit tool and then hold down the shift button to get this white hand here, this pan tool. So it lets you move in one direction around your object. And basically that's all about the navigation in SketchUp. So once again, you can zoom in with the mouse wheel, zoom out with the mouse wheel. You can click the mouse wheel and rotate around your dinosaur guy, or you can hold down the mouse wheel and hold down the shift button and then you move in one direction in your SketchUp world. And that's about it. Try to be comfortable with those three ways of navigating. And I will say this, I will say this often in the course, always have your left hand on your keyboard. And I personally, I have the thumb on the space button because the space button always gives you the mouse here, the select tool. So for example, if I have now the line tool and I hit the space button, you see that I'm going back to the mouse tool and I have my pinky on the shift button. So I can always get this hand here for panning. And also the other shortcuts are very easy to access if you have your left hand on the left side of your keyboard. So. That's all for the navigation in SketchUp.